Good morning, I'm Al Pearson and this is another edition of Tree Talk from Pearson Farm in Fort Valley, Georgia. And what do you think that is? That is a sigh of relief. You know, pecans right now, this is our pecan crop and it's looking great. And right now they're as heavy as they'll ever be. They're full of water, they have a thick hull on them and they're they're going to spend the next month ripening and making that great pecan kernel that, that we look forward to. And, uh, but they're very vulnerable at this time to high wind. And if you've been watching, if you've been awake for the last two or three days, you know that the, a hurricane just came through South Georgia and Florida and South Carolina. And so these trees are especially vulnerable and um, we sat, you know, grinding our teeth, hoping that the high winds were not going to come here. Well, we got about two and a half inches of rain, and there was some wind, but it was, uh, it just wasn't hurricane strength wind. And so we didn't lose a lot of trees. I'm certain that we lost some limbs, uh, but it wasn't anything like I was afraid of happening. We've had it happen before where we've had hundreds of pecan trees just pushed over and uh, we have to clean them up and you lose the crop and you lose the crop forever that that tree was going to produce. So it can be a real, real big impact on us if we have a hurricane hit directly this time of the year. But right now we're excited about these green um, pecans that are on their way to be real good. Um, we are mowing grass, uh, taking care of insects and diseases, um, and we are getting equipment ready so we can be ready to harvest around October 15th. And uh, we hope to be finished by Christmas. Sometimes we don't, but that's our pecan harvest season. And uh, it's a, this type of year, once this heat and, and hurricanes get out of the way, is a great time of year to be in a pecan orchard. But right now, our sights are set on pecans and uh, I'm tasting cinnamon right now when we, we shell them and we cook them and put cinnamon on them and other stuff. So I'm, uh, I'll have to stop talking because I'm drooling. Anyway, we uh, hope you'll visit us uh, either in person or on the web or by telephone, any way you want to do it. We'll be happy to hear from you. Come see us.